WRG News 5 starts right now with breaking news. Hi, everyone, and thanks for joining us. I'm Peter Albrecht. And I'm Roseanne Haven. More than 300 acres have burned in a brush fire in South Mobile County. Tonight, Alabama Forestry telling us southeast winds are pushing the fire north. News 5's Dana Winter joins us live near the Roy E. Ray Airport in Irvington, where she spoke tonight with firefighters and foresters. Dana? Well, Peter, Alabama foresters have left for the night, but they say the fire is not contained. They actually say it's on the other side of this very smoky wood line here. Now, this is some video of forestry taking off from the airport area. Foresters tell us today they got some extra help from Governor Kay Ivey. We're actually told she pushed through authorization allowing the National Guard to help fight this large brush fire with helicopters. Three helicopters dropped water on the fire today. Two were from the Alabama Law Enforcement Agency, and one was a National Guard Black Hawk. We spoke with Biola Battery's fire chief, who tells us they were most focused on saving homes. We were mainly here to protect these structures, you know, the, the residents, and uh, fortunately it didn't break through. So, so far, so good. We'll see what tomorrow brings. Currently, forestry says they're doing a burnout operation, and foresters tell me they will not say this fire is above 50% contained tonight because these winds are still strong and they could easily spark it right back up, which is exactly what they say happened around 3 o'clock this morning. Reporting live in Mobile County tonight, I'm Dana Winter for WKRG News 5.